You mentioned Ant. He seems like the funniest dudes of all time. We see the interviews and, and what he's like kind of from our perspective being in the media. But what, what's he like as a teammate and what's that dynamic like for you? Do you be able to play with a guy who's 21 mm -hmm. who, you know, he, we see the Jordan meme with the half Jordan face, the half Ant face, and, but he's really coming into his own yeah. now as, a, as an all-star superstar in this league. For sure. I mean, Ant, man, he's special. He's different. And that's on and off the court. Like, he's him no matter what type of situation he's in. Like, he's going to smile. He's going to. He's gonna impress you in so many different ways. So it's like, you know, to see him and come into his own. Uh, he's in his third year now, I believe. So to see him to come into his own in such a quick time is is crazy, man. This is like I've been with him all three of his years, and each year has been a step towards growth. And he's gonna be, a, a, I think, a, a great leader on this team. So Ant, Ant thinks that he can w literally win everything. He thinks he's the best at everything, no matter what it is. As he should. <laughs> Y'all ever get on Madden or 2K? And have you given that work before? <laughs> no, I haven't gotten on Madden or 2K, but we play uh, Warzone. Oh, uh, he's good. He, he's good in that. I ain't gonna lie. He he be working out in there. So he's telling the truth. He be okay. Yeah. I gotta know. You've been in the league for a minute now. Who is the biggest trash talker you've encountered? Like, you're a very laid-back guy, so I realize you were probably not bringing it on yourself in any ways, mm -hmm. necessarily, but who is the biggest trash talker? Like, the biggest trash talker that I've encountered, like, probably be, like, Bobby Portis. Really? Wow. Really? I could see that. Like, I, I've seen him say some crazy stuff. Are <laughs> you like, talking to himself or to you, though? I feel like, like Portis. To, like, he's scoring. He's talking to everybody. Like, he's, I love that. He's talking, he talking to, to y'all. Oh, right, right. <laughs> Whoever, like, he's talking to everybody. So it's just like, and it's another, you know, competitive spirit. It's like, gives you, you know, another reason to go back at him. For sure, for sure. And, um, yeah, he, he definitely makes you respect him, though. Like, I feel that. Like. Was there a, like, big name guy that kind of gave you a welcome to the league moment when you first got in? No, rookie year. I could not stop Porzingis. You couldn't stop Porzingis? Oh, was that unicorn. It just from half court. Yeah. Like, I'm like, how am I supposed to go? I'm looking at coach like, <laughs> only from the half court. Like, do I, you know, do I come up or do yeah. I? Because <laughs> like, I, I think I came up like a few times and he's, he, got, he drove by me. I think he had like 40 that game. I'm not going to lie. How many did you get? I mean, how many did he give you? Probably like. Cool, like 25, 30. You know, you know. So he had 25. I appreciate man. the honesty. You know, that, yeah, you could have been like, I was a rookie. So right, right, right. He's supposed really to do know, that. Yeah. Right, right, right. What's, right, co right. what's coach saying in that? Like, like he, just he's not really it. saying too much because he's shooting from half court. Like, yeah. logo. what did anybody do in the game about like, that? Yeah. You feel me? I'm just trying to. I'm trying to try to do something, right? Like, <laughs> trying to swim, man. You feel me? So you got to play with Cat for these past few years. Both of y'all are are bigs that like to get buckets from the perimeter. Mm -hmm. So what did you learn from playing with him and just just his style and, and how he's out there on the court? You know, if you watch the games and stuff. Even even now, like he's talking to me, um, you know, telling me what he sees from you know uh, players that's you know not in the game, but watching uh, perspective. I mean, you know. Like I said before, he's boosting my, my confidence, uh, just telling me, like, you know, to stick with and things of that nature. I mean, Cat's a great player. He's from Jersey, so you already, you mm -hmm. know, you already get that. Um, you have that, you already have that vibe. And then this is like, you know, what you, when you see him on the court, it's like, like you said about me, he's doing stuff that you're not supposed to be doing at that size and mm -hmm. shooting it crazy, like, from three. We play a lot of uh, shooting games after practice and stuff. It's like, I cannot beat this man. And it's like it, it makes me mad because this is like, bro. I only I think I only beat him like a couple times, like two, three times, bro. Like it makes me mad, but it gets it gets me um competitive. So. Mm -hmm.